Jennifer and I have been blessed more than we deserve, and one of our richest blessings is being led to this church. The first time we came to Farmer's Branch was in August 2001. We had overslept and decided instead of walking into our church 30 minutes late, we'd come to Farmer's Branch. We'd heard that Chris and Tara were here, and we wanted to hear Chris preach. What we didn't know was that that Sunday was going to alter our life. It was a rough time for us. Uh, we had been trying unsuccessfully for five years to have children, and it, had, uh, it was a struggle, and it had strained our relationships. It had strained our relationship with our family. It had strained our relationship between Jennifer and I, and it had restrained our relationship with God. And we had started asking questions like, is God listening to us? Does God hear our prayer? Is God even there? And we'd started to answer those questions, no. And so we slip into Farmer's Branch that Sunday morning and sit on the back row. And the, the theme of Chris's message that morning, I still remember this six years later, was God is there for you in your, the time of your struggle. And he showed a video clip of a track and field athlete, a sprinter, who during a race suffered a debilitating foot injury. And he collapsed and, and hit the track. And his father came down out of the stands and picked up his son, that athlete, and put his arm around his shoulder and walked with him across the finish line. And it was like Chris was talking directly to us that morning because he hit us right where we were. And we left the building and went out into the car and Jennifer just started bawling. And she, says, and she said, this is the first time in five years I feel like I've been fed. And we knew we were in a special place. Because the branch is a place that cares for hurt people and it cares for lost people. It's a place where it's okay not to be okay, where it's okay to admit that you don't have it all together, or that your life is not like you would like for it to be, or that your faith is waning. You don't have to check your humanity at the door when you walk in, and you don't have to put on an artificial shell. It really is a place that accepts people where they are, and then draws them into a deeper and more intimate relationship with Christ. And so this church has a special place in our hearts for what it's done for us, for what it's done for our children. It's an extraordinary feeling when your five-year-old son asks you, Dad, did you know that Christ died for us? This is a special place. And we're very excited about the task at hand. Our leadership is calling us to a worthy mission to expand the reach of God's kingdom, to go into a new community and to start a ministry there, and to create more space to bring in hurting people, to bring in lost people, to care for them, and to call them into a deeper and more intimate relationship with Christ. Jennifer and I are going to be at the Farmers Branch campus and we're excited uh, about what's going to be happening here. We're also excited about what our brothers and sisters are going to be doing up at Vista Ridge, about the, uh, the prospect of going into a new community and starting a ministry there. And we're energized about the ability that gives us at this campus here at Farmers Branch to have more space and more capacity to minister to people in this community. Until we joined the branch, we had not understood the blessing from the spiritual discipline of tithing. And candidly, it took us a little while to grow into that after we got here. But we feel like for a season, God is calling us into a greater commitment. And we are earnestly seeking God's counsel through prayer and through meditation to answer the question, God, what is it that you want to do through us in this campaign? And we're excited and a little bit nervous about where he's leading us on that journey. But we've learned to trust in God and to trust in His provision for our lives. Because now, six years after August of 2001, and the first time that we came to Farmer's Branch, we can look back and see that God was walking with us in our time of struggle, and that He has provided for us in a different way than we were expecting, but in a richer way than we could have ever anticipated. We are honored that God is calling us to join Him in His ministry here at the branch and we're anxiously awaiting to see where he's going to take this church next.